So Target was a little bit of a letdown. They had two of the things I was looking for, the vodka and champagne. But do you know what's not a letdown? I'll have a double-double with grilled onions and a small Diet Coke. Okay. Any fries for you? Uh, not today. Is this for in the car to go? Uh, for in the car. Okay. It'll be $5.75 for the first one. Though. Great, thank you very much. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. In and out, double double, grilled onions. Normally I'd get fries and I get the fries animal style, but today um, I already actually ate, which for me on a day off to eat twice before dinner is insane. There is a little bit of a habit of it sometimes being overhyped, and therefore sometimes there's some blowback from people who try it and don't think it's really that great. I mean, it's pretty much, I still think, the best fast food burger around. I mean, the only place that comes even remotely close as far as bigger chains go is gonna be something like Wendy's. In my lifetime now, I've easily had several hundred of these burgers, right? And I've maybe been notably disappointed with their service three times. Sorry, well, I've been disappointed with their quality maybe like three times, maybe four times. My camera's moving. How common is it that videographers trust um, like five or six dollar tripods to hold their multiple hundreds, in this case of this camera, I think it was the seven hundred dollar camera. Out of YouTube, Ducky here, aka the Murdoch, and we're back in this video with a little bit of a travel cinevloggy thingy. I'm gonna call this video a day off in the life of Ducky, at least currently. Uh, my life has mostly consisted of doing lots of household chores and work um, and preparing for my wedding that's coming up on November 20th. You're going to be watching my travels um, as I uh, search for some socks. I'm doing some yard work. Um, hopefully it's at least entertaining to watch on some level. I've taken care of a lot of things I had to do. I called the dentist. I paid, I think, all my bills that I needed to pay before you know, the wedding and honeymoon and all that. Um, I still haven't found the socks. Right now I'm at the mall in the search for silly socks for the groomsmen and possibly Velma as well. What are these yellow ones? I'm a big fan of yellow, it's one of my colors. This is kind of perfect, it's beer. Problem here is it looks like there's only two pairs. Lots of different colors, but nothing too silly. Uh, I think we found a winner here. I don't know that I'm gonna do any better than this. There are wedding colors, there's five pairs, that's what I need. I like the blue, the gray, and the yellow in particular. return some um, things like we got for Daisy's costume that didn't quite work out. Also, I'm on the lookout for some alcohol because it'll probably be a little bit cheaper here and I can use the gift card that I'm gonna ask for from the return to buy some um, ingredients because we're also testing stuff for the wedding. I'm testing drinks. Return is done. Now we're gonna go look for some socks and then some alcohol. Here we go. Need a vodka. Mm. There we go. Wait. Uh, well, this is just for experimenting anyway. Don't worry, kids. Just a grown ass man with alcohol in a shopping cart looking at the toys. All right, well, this stop isn't really for the, the silly socks, but if I'm doing a day off in the Life of Ducky video, um, this is a, a stop that I make a lot of my days off. Yep. Since Target failed me, here we are at BevMo. Here we go. That's for Ducky. That's for Velma. I know I need one of these. And one of these. One of these. Cinnamon schnapps. 
bottom shelf. We're here at Safeway giving the final ingredients to all the various drinks we need to make. Um, so we got an orange, a lime, milk, cream, and now I'm looking for some cranberry juice. Howdy YouTube, Ducky here, aka the Murduck, and we're back from all of our shopping with our alcohol. Let's see what we got. Simple syrup, sweetened lime juice, champagne, cinnamon schnapps, grand, grand marnier. We got some sweet and sour mixer, coffee liqueur, some cheap ass vodka, some badass bourbon, and some ginger beer along with a jigger. And now, let's see what we can make. First drink we're gonna try out for our signature wedding drinky type things is a cinnamon white Russian. So that's uh, how you make, sort of, a cinnamon white Russian. It's actually pretty good. I'm surprised it came out as nice without having like the cinnamon simple syrup, but the, the schnapps, the cinnamon schnapps adds a little bit of an extra kick, I think, but we still had the regular syrup in there for the sweetness or whatever. I also used a sweet cream, um, cream, because that was all I could find, but it's actually, it's pretty good. We will be drinking some of these at least one or two of these at our wedding. Definitely a lot of fun making all these drinks. Just to recap really quickly, Moscow Mule, Whiskey Sour, Cinnamon White Russian, and the uh, Champagne Cranberry Cocktail, orange whatever drink. Um, I like each of them to varying degrees. We'll see what we go with. Um, but I guess that's gonna do it for now. Just to give myself a little bit of a sign off in case I need it. Um, if you enjoyed this video for whatever reason, go ahead and like. If you're not already subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. As I always say, it makes me feel like I accomplished something. Um, something beyond just making four different types of mixed drinks that I, I don't wanna waste, so I'm gonna drink all of them. Maybe I won't. Thanks for tuning in. You guys have a good night, and I guess I'll see you in the next one.